I really want you to answer me if it's really worth continuing with Juju Smith-Schuster on the team. But first, I would like to say that if you, like me, are a fanatical fan of the Kansas City Chiefs, subscribe to the channel, because I will always bring you daily news about the best team in the NFL, our beloved Chiefs. The Kansas City Chiefs have a handful of important and pivotal free agent decisions to make this offseason after coming off their second Super Bowl victory in the last four years. For the most part, the success of their offseason could be determined by what they decide to do with their own in-house free agents. One of their biggest decisions comes with that of wide receiver Juju Smith-Schuster. When Smith-Schuster first signed his one-year deal with Kansas City in the offseason, it was designed to allow him to somewhat revive his career with the Chiefs' rack-up numbers, hit incentives, and re-enter hit the market again a year later. At that point, he could cash in after proving he was still an impact receiver in this league. In the end, Smith-Schuster recorded 78 catches for 933 yards and 3 TDs during the 2022 season. Not quite a great season for Smith-Schuster but a pretty good one where you could also argue would have been a great one if not for some bad injury luck. He was the number one wide receiver on a Super Bowl winning team and ended up being critical in the second half of the game. All in all, that's a strong resume to head into free agency with. Juju Smith-Schuster may not be so expensive for KC Chiefs after all. Most fans would like to hold on to Smith-Schuster but fear that Kansas City may not be able to retain him due to price. Although Smith-Schuster was good for the Chiefs this past season, the wide receiver market has exploded recently and there aren't many big-name free agent wide receivers this year. Teams that are desperate for a receiver may be willing to pay around $20 million per year, which seems far too rich for Smith-Schuster. Keeping Smith-Schuster isn't a must, but it would be nice. Another year in this offense and another training camp and offseason of building chemistry with Patrick Mahomes could mean a more productive year next season. Keep in mind that Smith-Schuster is still just 26 years old. Keeping a young, productive receiver around that still may have some upside would be ideal. We have reached the end of another video. Check if you subscribe to the channel and left a like on the video. Until the next news.